In this video, we are going to learn about the UCS system. UCS stands for User Coordinate System. So in every drawing, we have to create the sketches or drawing with reference to any references. So there are two types of references. One is Cartesian and one is Polar. In Cartesian, we have XY references. In Polar, we have angle value like sin theta, cos theta references as we know. Also in this AutoCAD, we have these references in 2D modeling. So I select the drawing and select this top view. So when we draw something on this working environment, we will draw according to the coordinate points. Suppose I take the line command and then it will ask us to choose two coordinate points, X and Y points. We can specify the two points here and draw the line as we know up about this. In the left, we can see the XY plane here. This is called the UCS icon. We can change this UCS icon according to our requirements. So first thing for this UCS is the command is the UCS icon. This is the UCS icon, press enter. And here we have some options. If we want to turn on, on this or show this UCS icon, it will select this on. Then off, all, no origin, origin, selectable and properties. If I select this close, it will turn off this UCS icon. And we can find it back, just select this UCS icon, then select this on. And this point is the zero zero point. And the default environment is called World Coordinate System, that is WCS. So we can change this with some references. Suppose once again I type the command UCS and here is command UCS. And we can change this reference according to this reference object like face, name, object, view, world and with any XYZ plane etc. We can drag this and place it anywhere and then specify the angle value whichever we want and this will be our new coordinate system and this is now our new origin we will learn how to use this coordinate system suppose i draw a rectangle here this is the rectangle and if we want to something perpendicular to this rectangle we can simply do this i take a line i will turn on the ortho mode and suppose I want this midpoint and draw a vertical line. Right click enter and it will create a line perpendicular to this horizontal line. Now we will make some changes in it. I undo this line. Then I select this rotate command. Select this rectangle complete, press enter. That is the base point and give it some angle. Suppose I give the angle 15 degree and press enter. This is now a tilted rectangle. Now I want to create perpendicular line to this inclined rectangle. So let us see how we do this. I take the line command, select this midpoint and draw this line. So our reference we can see is this horizontal line and it is creating this line here. One way is that we can remember the angle and we know this 90 plus 15 will be 105. So that is a mathematical calculation and in complex geometry, we cannot do this all the time. Another way we can find is that suppose I turn on this ortho and we will think that it will create the perpendicular. So it is creating perpendicular with this reference. These are X, Y references. So I cancel this command here. We find that we cannot create the perpendicular with this UCS. So we have to change this UCS according to our object. So I type in the command UCS and in the reference, I give this object as a reference and select the coordinate. Suppose I would select this point. In the preview, it will show that if we want this point to be on this one, one is left side and one is upward. I want on both the inside. So I take the cursor to the inside. 
okay that is good view i click here and we see our grid also change with respect to this object now our grid are displaying that this is our vertical and this is now horizontal now we can create a complete perpendicular line i select this line from this midpoint and we can see our reference is now this line and we can take any value right click enter this way we can change our ucs systems now if we want to go back to our original or default ucs or which we call the wcs world coordinate system we just once again have to type the command ucs press enter and select this world and we will be back in our default coordinate system